it's the energy vibration <clears throat> reading for um the tour uh, the capricorn sun moon rising sign i want to say thank you for being here welcome all newcomers thank you for the wonderful like shares and support please um remember to cross watch and listen to your sun moon rising sign hat is the four week fourth and last week of the month of october i want to say to each and um each and every one of you please um, remember to listen to the moon readings the moon readings are how the extended reading or to be um, you can find the extended reading from um, the on-demand and um, please um, try and download it it's just a cup of coffee um, and um, please like share these videos and listen to the moon energy vibration leads in because there are so many things that is going to be coming in okay so let's see what's coming up for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising what's happening for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising wonderful energies wonderful energies is coming up for the Capricorns the ace of cups is also coming up for the Capricorns <laughs> Okay, I'm laughing because um <laughs> okay, so okay, let's see. Um call him up on the angels and guides of the Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay, there's a message that fell out. Um, you're spiritually protected, whatever is happening. Um, you're going to um victory and success over um, <clears throat> some things that is happening in your life you have the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out in this week you have the energy of the two of Pentacles you have to make uh, some decision you have overcome a situation we have the two of swords which you're seeing clearly what has been transpiring and you have uh, the four of ones which is fabulous fabulous you Capricorn so okay and I was laughing because my um, my guys were saying yeah, take this take this <laughs> and um, doing these readings because you're a channel um, so and the same thing that they were saying take this take this it comes out anyway so wonderful energies is here it is the wheel of fortune it's a week of a fire energy Monday and Tuesday is air zodiac energy and uh, um, <clears throat> the zodiac change on um, oh my god nine and nine and um, twice nine is in this week this is so fabulous 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 now some of you are going to be having a situation with a nine of swords okay Whoever this nine of swords is, um, he is um, between the ages of twenty-five and forty-five. So some of you older persons are going to be ha um, having a situation with the nine of swords. Not to worry because um, he's not God. Okay, it's like you showed him. Hey, I don't know who you are, but you know, no. Let's see. He's a someone from your past life. He could be a soul family. Okay, so we are going to be looking and see. How is he going to affect you guys? This is a beautiful week, if you ask me. Um, let's look at the situation. Um, on Monday, we have the energy of victory and success. You're going to in war, and you're going to win because you come out with a strong foundation. You are about to go in war on Monday, and you're going to be winning because you come out in a strong foundation. Your wishes and dreams are going to be good whoever the source is that is coming at you the nine of ones is here you are ready and you're standing and you're ready for anything that is going to be coming at you a new love is about to enter your life okay uh, it's not a baby it's someone new is coming in a new love is coming in now this person could be coming from a past life we're going to be seeing who is this new love um and you could be receiving this energy of love coming to you on Tuesday you have to make a decision about this person that is coming in a new love is coming in you need to make a decision about this person it could be that this person is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra he's coming in and he's coming in very forceful and you need to make a, a decision whether or not I want to have this person in my life or this is not the person I'm looking for okay 
some of you Capricorns can if you were born January um, if you were born in January um, going on five days um, before the changing of the signs you could go in a relationship with this um, Knight of Swords so if you were born January between the 14 and the 19 you could go in a relationship with this person for the rest of you Capricorn stay away from um, air sign people okay it's it's not a good relationship okay now Saturday you're gonna be um, Saturday um, you're connecting with someone but you're listening to what they have to say whatever they have to say this new person is coming in your life whatever they have to say you're listening and you're protecting yourself you're listening to them and you're protecting them yourself so it is a week of nine endings and you have to make decision and you're going to be seeing a situation for what it is but you have strong foundation your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out and you have strong foundations so let's go deeper and look and see what is going to be happening because a new love is coming in for some of you the spurses and Aries Leo or Sagittarius you have to make a decision about um, you know is it really truly love is it the sex what am I feeling what's happening for it um, for myself you have to take the time to do that before you are going to make a decision to go forward you have a strong foundation whatever that is happening in your life the nine of ones is here and especially with this new love that he's coming in very fast so be carefully I don't like men or people coming in my life so fast there is something that you're not being honest about okay there energy of the seven of swords a challenge so whoever this um, this 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 person is this person is an Aquarius Gemini or Lib or Libran <clears throat> be aware of this person because he's coming in um, like the energy of um, he's coming in with the energy for, like um, uh, a casting over energy fast you know I'm so in love with you and I've always been in love with you and I just want to be with you and I just fell in love with you the first time I saw you really <laughs> that's then that, that, that's how I always go oh really okay uh, all right I, um, I need to think about this you know that's how I deal with it this is basically so beware of this person coming in Ace of Cups and the Nine of Wands. Ace of Cups and the Nine of Wands. <laughs> <Ooh>, okay. <laughs> okay. For you, man, there is a woman that is also an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra coming in at you. You're spiritually protected against this person. Don't believe this person, whatever is happening. Your wishes and dream coming out yep you have seen some of you have seen this little girl for who she is it could be your daughter it could be a friend of your daughter it could be a family friend um, it could be someone on the work floor but this person she is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra okay this person you never trust her and you were right not to trust her okay this person you never trust her and you were right not to trust her somehow this person got in connection with you whether it's through your new love or however but this person and you come in connection with each other you never trust her you think I'm not trusting you there's just something about you um, that I'm, I'm feeling not to trust okay let's see what is happening for the two of Pentacles some of you men oh yeah so some of you men between the ages of 25 and 45 um, there is this little girl this is a girl who came in as a new love um, you're not gonna trust her 
um, listen to your your gut feelings because here it is it's as if she came in so fast she's in reverse when someone is in the reverse they're not coming in for the right reason and she could be oh I'm so divinely in love with you and whatever it's all about the money don't believe this lady it's it's just basically all about money people be aware of this little young lady that is coming in because uh, trust me you have no idea who she is it could be for some of you your daughters coming in plain um, plain you for some things so be aware of this the outcomes is the organization and now um, the energy of the Queen of Cups is here okay some of you are dealing with the energy of um, a lady this lady is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion whatever the situation is and whatever that was happening you're gonna overcome what this lady was trying to do you are going to be justifying something and overcoming what this lady tried to do okay um, whatever is, is, is there is sad so, um, there is some um, stuff that was happening the seven of ones is they create um, this lady and this little girl create a lot of illusion and you are going to overcome them okay you're spiritually protected your spirit guide shows you people are going to be coming to you to let you know what happened um, some of you who men between the age of 25 and 45 as I look at this is that um, this lady came to you and asked you to do something you did it and now you're seeing the reason why um, you're seeing that this this little girl was sent by um, someone who is a uh, here this little girl was sent by this lady this lady is an Pisces cancer or scorpion she was sent by this lady now there someone in an organization is seeing a situation they are seeing what has exactly transpired and you have a strong foundation whoever you are they have seen what has transpired and you have a strong foundation your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through um, because people start to see the truth of a situation people start to see exactly what has happened what has transpired people see start to see a solution is going to be coming out because I'm seeing here that you're moving forward and you're saying hell no and people are going to be um, you're moving forward and you're saying hell no and people are going to be respecting you um, for um, what you have done um, some respect is going to be coming in um, to you for what has transpired some real respect is going to be coming in to you this was a karmatic situation whoever this person um, is of was there was a new love but it was not new love it was just someone came in with a false intention of new love okay and this is someone from the past this is a karma a karmatic situation that has happened it's a false love from the past and you saw it okay it's all about money it's all about money and you st you stand a strong foundation and you are going to be very very successful there are a lot of opportunities and offers that is going to be coming to you some of you is going to be receiving an offer from a lady that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, you know you're at a crossroad and uh, um, this person is going to be helping you you're at crossroad and this person is going to be helping you whatever the situation is or was you are really at a crossroad and this person is going to be offering you help okay what I'm, I'm basically singing because um, whatever is happening is that you're moving forward no matter what you're moving forward and you're going to be receiving the help 
now the situation that is transpiring here it's all about money and you are financially stable it's all about money okay your wishes and dream about money is it's going to be happening your financial stability in um, whatever is, is transpiring some of you are going to be receiving um, money um, from an organization and this organization a lot of organization because I'm seeing some of you paid out money for its business to be done it wasn't done they lied and they have to return the money to you uh, the, the money has to return to you okay because there was some lies in deception now whoever is coming at you who's an Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, think think before you act um, think before you act you ladies think before you act okay think before you act um, the ten of Pentacles is here I'm saying um, you ladies are going to be coming in some money it could be um, past life your family is going to be there your family is going to be helping you it could be past life because I'm saying the energy of the hermit and the knight of swords okay and these are past life situation and um, you ladies um, especially what I'm saying is that um, the skin of source is coming but think before you act think before you act um, think before you say anything this is all about going within and think about this person or what the information is coming at you because information is coming of you or this person is coming at you because they want to have a relationship or they want it to you know think before you hack it has something to do um, with family money Think before you act okay it has something to do with family money think before you act I want to say to you guys let's see what other energies is coming up for you guys oh what other energies are coming up for the Capricorn tick 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 yep you're about to explode but hold it in you guys are about to explode but hold it in it is um, a karmatic cycle is a lesson that you haven't learned um, this is a karmatic situation is a lesson that you haven't learned what I would say to you guys is keep away from people who are coming back from the past keep away from people who are coming back from the past okay because you're going to just lost it you're just going to just use your sword of truth to cut through the bullshit and said I no longer need this situation in my life because you can see this happening okay you have a very very strong foundation whatever is happening and you're going to be telling people hey um, this is a karmatic situation I don't need the bulls in my life whenever the we can um, whatever and whenever um, the situation we can deal with the situation then we'll deal with the situation but you're not going to push me um, um, I'm waiting until things uh, and you know whoever comes in your life whether it's your child that is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, be careful of this person okay this person is a little bit off and I gotta go it's 18 minutes I love you guys please remember to watch the moon reading and I will speak to you next time